So there's the golf course. If I pan to the left, there's Harris. Harris has the hotel, Horseshoe has the poker room, neither has both. So the Dodge golf course right next to Harris. And as I was walking over here, an errant tee shot found its way into the parking lot. I figure the guy isn't like me. I would just play it as it lies, off the concrete included. Figure he won't do that, so I'm just gonna grab this for him and throw it back to him. Here we go. Should I ask him what it is? Titleist? It's a Callaway. You want the one that wound up in the parking lot? Oh, yeah. You. You're welcome. So there's the green through the trees. It's a nice course. I played it once when I used to play. But today, it's the vacation. I need the hotel. Here is the inside of the hotel room. Pretty solid for Council Bluffs. Bathroom's all right. Bed's all right. Got my laptop over on the table where the bad lighting is. But it's a solid room. TV swivels, gotta have a cigar, of course. But some people in the comments wanted to know about my uh, Iowa expenses. So unlike when I was in law school, when I went somewhere in the summer to play poker and had to keep paying rent in Nebraska, and then in addition to that, pay my room rates wherever I went, I'm only paying room rates out here right now. No uh, contracts. No leases going on in Vegas, it's just here. So the Airbnb, 43 nights, total of $1,581.84. If you want to go by night, $36.79 per night. And if you want to go per month, I would just multiply the nightly by 365 and then divide by 12. Not every month has the same number of days, so... Our average month has like 30.4, $1,118.94 per month, if you wanted to look at it that way. And uh, that's about it. The food is pretty low because of the uh, Laurel Lounge. A lot of days I eat for free. It's not great food, but I get so many hours here, I don't have uh, as much time available outside poker as in Vegas when I'm like hopping casinos, walking by a lot of restaurants, things like that. So I'm not eating as much. I think so far, including, you know, on the road, it's up around $95 in food for the month. I will tell you the gas. So I started with a full tank of gas when I left on June 1st. I filled up my tank at the end of May. So in addition to the full tank, I spent about $155 in gas to get here. Uh, I haven't filled up once I got here. I think the last time I filled up was, I don't know, somewhere in central Nebraska. Don't remember exactly. So... Um, I only drive about five miles from the Airbnb to the casino, so I don't spend a lot on gas once I'm here. I mean, it was the getting here that was the big deal. And, uh, that's about it for now. Uh, rent in is about 1100 and if my face is really red, it's because I was just outside. It's, uh, very hot out, also very windy, but I guess the redness is due to the heat more than the wind. Um, in Maryland in 2020, I spent about 1100 also. Uh, most of the time I was in a townhouse about a mile from Maryland Live. In Vegas, uh, I did that video um, after four months of the year were finished. It was about 7 11 I was paying in room rates. Uh, Windstar was really bad. Windstar, last year, I was there seven weeks in Oklahoma, was like 1600 So the 1100 is fine, especially considering how many more hours I'm going to get without wasting time casino changing and being in good games. Time goes by very fast at these tables. It's not like uh, Vegas. In Vegas, there are times I feel like I've played five hours and I look at the time and it's been like an hour, ten minutes. And out here, there are times it feels like I've played about an hour and a half and it's been like six hours. So time goes by faster. I'm going to get a lot of hours in uh, after this vacation. 
I have uh, 30 days left before I leave town. So we'll see uh, at the end, maybe at the end of uh, June, I'll give you one month. You know, not the estimates, not the projections, what actually happened, my expenses in June. And then uh, that and or when I'm done in July, because it'll be about a month and a half. So we could, you know, extrapolate it out to two months or we could multiply everything by two thirds, get it back down to one month if that's easier for people to uh, visualize or something like that. So there are my expenses for now and uh, we'll see what happens when uh, a month is done and my time in Iowa is totally done.